Psalms 23, 5. And this is why God allows your enemies to watch you, to stalk you, to see what you're doing. And doesn't remove them all from your life right away. So let's get into it. Psalms 23, 5. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Preparing a table before our enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil. He anoints us with oil. My cup runneth over. He fills our cup metaphorically and physically running over. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. So this is a, a scripture that, that assures you that, yeah, your enemies are watching because they don't like you. Because they don't like the God presence in you. They don't like the Holy Spirit shining through you. They don't like that you're Christ-like. So God allows them to watch you. You may block some. They may fake accounts. You, they may stalk your home. They may stalk you. Watch you from afar. Watch you on your social media. From fake pages. And all that. But you know what? God allows it. Because he wants them to see you shine. He wants to, he wants to use you. As God's testimony, not just our testimony, but we, we, when we walk with God, we're God's testimony. Do you think God's testimony is going to be, be sucky? No, God's, de God's testimony is going to be great. It's going to be a biblical story in modern day times. So he, 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 he's, this is saying that while they're watching us or while they're around us, even your friends can be your foes. While they're around us, God is going to present us a glorious table a feast before our enemies he's going to give us clout views financial abundance um happiness smiles you know all the good things in front of our enemies and our, our enemies will be jealous they'll be envious and they'll see that like you know why did god pick that guy why did god help him why did it you know what i mean they'll they'll ask themselves so many different questions you know why god helps us because we follow God, because we read about God, because we get closer to God, because we put God in our life. And they're so envious, and that envious takes over them because it's a demonic nature. And that envy, they just want to see your downfall. And that's where they fall short, because God will present us with blessings in front of our enemies, with financial blessings, blessings of family, friends, uh, material blessings, blessings of maybe you post a video and you get clout for it or you get a lot of views god does that on purpose because they're watching and they're watching closely and that's why god works and he wants to make them mad because god is god has a sense of humor and guess what the sense of humor is guess who's the punchline in every joke of god the enemy satan those who come against us they're the punchline <laughs> so you know what i mean while we're being happy and we're trying to elevate and get closer to God, they're envious and they have a ulterior and wicked motive. When we're just trying to do good and help people and spread the gospel, they're envious. That, that makes me feel sad for them. It makes me still feel sad for the enemy because all they have in their heart is wickedness, judgments, and gossip and rumors. And the whole time we're just trying to do good and speak truth and speak the gospel and help other people you know what i mean how does that look they're, they're envious and just want to see your downfall while we're doing good and reading the gospel and helping people tell me how that looks that's why god gives us blessings because we try to walk in our morals and values